MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. Now, what a great advertisement this machine shop is for Fanon. To the right of me, I've got four robo drills, and behind me, two EDM machines. Jeff, Protocol Engineering, tell us about your business. It's a family business. It's been running now for 50 years here in South End. Um, we're, we're mainly dealing with the aerospace, medical, and electronic industries. And in terms of what you actually do here, milling, turning, are there any other disciplines as well? Uh, we, we're into wire erosion as well, um, and grinding, honing, press work. And are you a big employer in the area, or one of the biggest businesses, so in terms of subcontract engineering around here? Um, I, I would say probably in the aerospace industry um, as, as a subcontractor. And so we're here to talk about the FANUC machines, or to look at the FANUC installation. You've got seven machines here, would that be correct? It FANUC? is, yeah. We've got five um, robo drills and two robo cuts. So there must have been uh, some reasons that you when you started buying FANUC, you carried on buying FANUC machines. Would it be possible to highlight some of those? The reliability in the main, I think, is, is, is the main selling point of a FANUC. Obviously, they are good, um, efficient, reliable, accurate machines, um, but it's the reliability in the main. We, we very rarely ever have problems with them. So behind me here is the latest addition to the machine shop here at Protocon. This is a FANUC robo drill that's got 24,000 RPM. Now this enables them to reduce their cycle times and this supporting bracket that they're machining here is actually a cycle time of less than four minutes. Now with this being the high power version, it means it's not only capable of machining high speeds on aluminium like we've just seen, but it's also got a lot of torque. So if there's more difficult materials, you can, uh, you can achieve Good results on that too. Uh, obviously they've beefed up the, um, the spindle uh, to give you that extra power um, and there are times when, when you, you need that. Aerospace is mainly into um, the aluminiums and, and the lighter materials so um, from our point of view we, we, we're um, using a lot of small cutters and to get that RPM yes it's a great advantage. Now a growing part of Protocon's business is EDM machining and for that they've recently selected a new C400 for FANUC. You go for FANUC EDM, does it, does it lend itself because you've got the machining centres so there's compatibility there, is that the reason? No, not really. Uh, again, they're very reliable and, um, and from that point of view um, that's good, but I mean, obviously, if you need servicing, you can you can then accommodate both types of machine uh, at uh, one time. And uh, final, on a final note, um, uh, Protocon, we've been around the machine shop today, and it's been very, very impressive. So I, I thank you for that, Jeff. But uh, you've got a lot of machines. Have you got more space for more? Potentially we could because um, the, the, the building we're in at the moment, um, we, we could um, revamp that and change things around. And yes, we, I mean it's got to be the aim in the long run to, to uh, continually uh, increase and improve. And when we talk about increasing and improving, maybe there's also potential to continue buying higher spec, faster machines which actually mean you need less spindles. Um, well, I guess that is that that, that is an option, but um, I mean the type of work we do, which is small batch runs, um, doesn't necessarily lend itself to more sophistication. The lean principle is the um, small em smallest envelope for the machine, and and, um, and and the FANUX fit that completely. And as for your business, what what was the key to your successes, and and what do you see for the future? We we do provide a very very good quality service. 
um, and, and that's what we, we're in business to do. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.